Hey, hey, hey. Hey, everyone. How's everyone doing today? Hope everyone is having a fantastic day. Well, guys, today I have for you some lemon sugar cookies. And here is the ingredients for the recipe. You need one cup of unsalted butter, two cups of granulated sugar, add two large eggs, two tablespoons of lemon juice. You can use the lemon juice in a bottle or you can use the lemon, the, re the regular lemons. I use the regular lemons because it makes the flavor come through more. I use about a tablespoon of lemon zest, a teaspoon of vanilla, or you can use a teaspoon of a, a half a teaspoon of vanilla and a half a teaspoon of the lemon extract. Up to you how you want to do it. Three cups of flour. I use a teaspoon of baking powder, a half a teaspoon of baking soda, and a half a teaspoon of salt. And I stirred all of this together by hand. I did not use a mixer. I used my hands and the cookies came out perfectly. As you can see here, I am adding the baking powder in there. I'm just mix everything up in the bowl. I mix the butter and the granulated sugar first, and I got that uh, incorporated really good. You know, you put your wrist to work. You, you put your wrist to work and you start working it, and, you know, you really didn't need, uh, because these are just sugar cookies, so you really didn't need a mixer to mix these. Um, so I used my hands, and I, 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 I just let that wrist went to working. Yes, I did. So I, I uh, added two eggs to this as well. And then what I did, I used my zest thing to zest up some lemon. And I added those zest in there. And that what makes that cookie pop. I'm telling you, it makes that cookie pop. So I added my uh, sugar and I added it slowly. I didn't add all of it at once. I added it slowly. That's what I did with the flour. I didn't add all of my flour at once. I added it, you know, in, in, you know, in different intervals. And one thing you don't want to do, you don't want to over mix your cookies. So you want to make sure that you, you know, you get it incorporated, but you don't want to just keep stirring and stirring and stirring until you over mix because you're going to come out with a tough cookie. My cookies came out soft. They was kind of hard a little bit around the edges, which that's the way I like it and soft in the center. So the cookie was, it came out really great. Because I did not over mix this cookie. But as you can see right here, I'm just stirring the sugar and this butter and getting it all incorporated. I'm telling you, it, it this, this recipe is really easy to do. Because you're putting everything in the bowl. You ain't got to stop over and do this and stop over and do that. But you're putting everything in the bowl and you're just stirring everything together. Yes, this, this was all right. It was an all right uh, recipe. So anybody can make this recipe as, as simple as that. But anyway, I hope that you all enjoy this recipe. I hope that you all give it a try. And uh, I pray that all is well in your life right now. I pray that, you know, that God will continue to touch you, continue to bless you, continue to give you your heart's desire as we come up on the end of this year. I'm so grateful and so thankful for how God has kept me through this year. And as we come upon uh, 2024, we have to look past the what was went on in 23 and move forward to 24 to make it better and to get closer to God. Get a little closer to God. If you haven't gotten close to him or if you're thinking about it, you know, or you're maybe saying that I'm trying to get out of this. Oh, what I'm in? No, just go to him. He's waiting for you. He's waiting patiently for you. So just go and, you know, just go talk to him. Have a little talk with Jesus. It'll make everything all right, I promise. So as you see right here, I'm zesting up the lemon. And you got to make sure that you don't uh, get that white part because that's bitter. And it'll cause your cookie to be a little bitter taste. 
So you just want to get the lemon zest that's on top because it has that oil in the lemon. And see, I'm zesting so hard, I done dropped the lemon, but that's all right. I got the job done. I did. So as I pull the lemon off into the mixture, and um, yeah, th I'm telling y'all, this lemon zest really brings out that cooking. It really brings it to another level. And you can actually taste that lemon zest in the cookie. Oh, yeah, you sure can. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. So how many people are going out of town for the holidays? Are you having people coming in for the holiday? You know, right after that will be the new year coming in. Uh, you know, some people come and they stay the whole week. And some, you know, come the, the night before New Year's Eve. But um, I won't have family coming in this time because a lot of my family, they're going to uh, Disney World. They're going to uh, Florida. And, um, yeah, they're going to enjoy their Christmas in Florida. And, and, you know, by the time, you know, when they get back, they're not going to want to travel anymore. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. I may end up going to Houston Christmas Eve, I mean, New Year's Eve. I haven't really, uh, you know, made a decision about that yet. Because, like I said, you know, I have family that lives in the Houston area. Uh, so, yeah, I may be going that way to Houston, but I'm not really sure yet. But anyway, y'all, thank you all. Thank you guys so very much for, you know, watching the video. Thank you guys for rocking with me. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you guys for coming on and, and, you know, looking at my videos, clicking on my videos. That means so much to me. And I thank you so very much for doing that. You know, because if, it's, if it wasn't for you guys, you know, I wouldn't be where I'm at today. I wouldn't, you know, I, I just wouldn't be there. So I appreciate each and every one of you. So very appreciative. And I thank you so very much. I thank the guy. I thank you guys for my, I thank you for my members. Um, I thank you so very much for you all for rocking, still rocking with me. I appreciate you guys so very much, more than you will ever know. I appreciate you. And um, one thing I want to say, you know, if you would like to donate to the channel, um, you know, to keep me being able to do videos like I do the cooking videos, um, you can donate uh, through Cash App, Dollar Sign, uh, Money R, Sarah Money R. That's dollar sign, Sarah, money, or. And if you want to, you know, you can do that as well. So uh, just anything, you know, to help uh, to help with the channel. You know, as you know, food is high. But I'm not, I'm not begging anybody for anything. I'm just asking if you would like to donate. You know, it's up to you. Regardless of what, I'm going to still rock with you guys. I'm going to still put content out, you know, by the grace of God that it's going to still happen. But I appreciate you guys so very much. And as you can see, these cookies came out perfect. Perfect. I made them smaller this time. I didn't want the large cookies. But these came out perfect. You can see the uh the yellow zest in it. Wow. They came out really good. So, guys, thank you so very much. Make sure you thumbs up this video. And don't forget to share love everywhere that you go. When you go out there and do something for yourself, do something for someone else as well. All right. Oh, yeah, guys. I put this in the oven on 310 for about six, seven minutes. Um, and it came out perfect. So, you can do that as well. But I will see you on the next video. Y'all have a great, beautiful, and wonderful day. And remember to live. Remember to live. You know, live your life. Okay? I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.